Next item is consideration to approve a conditional use permit for 6.06 .06 acres for property at the northwest corner of the intersection of Dave Ward Drive and South Country Club. This was reviewed by the Planning Commission at their meeting on December 19th of 2022. And at that time, the commission voted six to nothing at the request be forwarded to City Council with a recommendation of approval. And we have an ordinance to read for this item. No, we don't. Mm -hmm. No, this is a conditional use permit. It's a conditional use. Conditional use permit is what we're looking at. And, and help me if I'm clarifying this right. This is to uh, a conditional use permit to allow an automobile service station in a C2 zone for property located at 3200 Dave Ward Drive. Is that correct? Yes, uh, correct. So uh, previously the property was zoned, um, zoned commercial to allow uh, development of of harps um, with that we recommend that they go c2 uh, there's a conditional use permit that's required for a fuel service station or automobile service station uh, we've got uh, 13 uh, conditions uh, on here uh, with that i think the the main one would be development of the use would be arranged in a manner to provide adequate buffering and screening to adjacent uses uh, the planning director would be empowered to determine in consultation with the applicant appropriate screening and buffering uh, requirements. So that that is the, out of those 13 conditions, that's really the, the primary one there uh, in order to buffer it properly from the, the uh, adjacent property. Harps is not coming? No, Harps is. This is the yeah. yes. gas. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so was there any discussion about hours of operation since that seems to be a hot thing at the moment? Uh, not at not at this location. It, the one out west is closing by eleven. Do we know? I mean, no, I just pre, didn't know. It. That was pre-COVID. I think they closed even earlier now. I do think we have some. Do we have some folks here that like to speak for this as well? Come on up, sir. What's up, Jeffrey? I'm representing New Life Church, which is an adjacent property owner. Um, First of all, Harps has been incredibly generous to us in conversations. We're very much in favor of them coming into this location. We do you have some concerns from the, uh, from the orientation of the building from the Planning Commission? Uh, I believe the traffic report noted close to 4,000 cars per day on, on the impact to us. Their primary entrance will be our private drive, not Country Club. And what we are asking the council is to help us reconsider. We want this to happen. We're excited about it. And again, Harps has been incredible to work with, um, much different than the last item on the uh, agenda tonight. Um, so they, they've been very generous to us in everything that we've asked for. But we are very concerned about the private drive and the amount of cars on our private drive that runs down the middle uh, of our property. Um, so with the current configuration, it would route almost all traffic to the front of the building, which would be on that private drive. We're also concerned, we do have a daycare operating on our facility. We're concerned about anybody that may pull through our parking lot, including 18 wheeler traffic um, to the Harps because of the orientation of the building. What we would prefer is that uh, the Harps would face Country Club and any improvements be made to Country Club to allow that to happen in that fashion. Have, have y'all have y'all been in conversation with Harps about this? Harps is more than willing, and and Sarah with Harps Corporation is here. She'll she'll attest to this in just a moment. This is the city's desire, or the Planning Commission's specifically's desire, to make sure that the uh, Dave Ward corridor is correct. James, you, I want you to speak to that because I don't want to put words in your mouth. Um, but uh, but yes, the Harps Corporation is fine with either orientation from our previous conversation. Any questions from New Life? Ma'am, would you like to come up and speak? You state your name and address, please, for the record. Sarah Hopper, 918 South Gutenson in Springdale. Um, and I'm here representing HARPS. And what Seth said is accurate, that we are okay with facing west or east. Um, but through working with the Planning Commission, um, they've asked us to change that orientation. Um, and so we're okay with either. We just want all the parties to be happy with what we do. 
not the, so it's the planning department, not the planning commission that has a problem with the way you want to turn it? Yes, I, I and there's some specific reasons that they've given um, for that. But uh, for this project to work, we do have to have new life support. Right. Um, so we won't be able to do it without their support. So I can get this right in my head. I know that New Life has a, uh, an ingress and egress off of, of Country Club. Would y'all add an, uh, a new one? Yes, I think we would be able to have one drive off of Country Club. Uh, but that would, uh, I'm trying to make sure I say the direction right. I think right now we would be facing west, and so it would kind of come into the back of the store, which I think is what the church's concern is, is that, most people are going to want to drive around to the front to the parking lot. Okay. And okay. use the access drive. And we're not able to get another drive off of Dave Ford. Yeah, that would require a pretty good act. Uh, that would require the uh, State Highway Board of Directors. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. Yeah. As well as the city and RDOT. Yeah, because we would be willing to do, you know, a ride-in sweep or anything like that. But from my understanding, that that's not really an item that they can be flexible on. James, would, would you give your the, the planning end. department's thoughts yeah. on this, please? Yeah. Um, in in meeting with the the applicant, um, we we looked at several things in considering this. Doing a path analysis, if you're coming from the south, the most convenient way to enter the property is off of South Country Club. If you're coming from the east on Dave Ward, uh, you would likely split trips between Country Club and the, the New Life Access. If you're coming from westbound, or no, eastbound on Dave Ward, so heading towards the east on Dave Ward, you would likely turn at the at the light, go on to Country Club. If you're coming from Country Club, you would likely enter from Country Club. So I think my consideration, you know, in, in evaluating that and, and having, uh, I, I used to live in uh, Capitol View and we'd go up to the Fancy Kroger on, on Cantrell and we always entered through the back. We never entered through um, Cantrell because it was the more convenient way to access it was off. So off. which way is is Harps facing, in, in in the way you want it done? So right in now? in the scenario in the scenario in which um, the what what's favorable to New Life would be for the front of the facility to face towards Country Club, the considerations that in in looking at this planning department has said it would it would likely have fewer impacts and and be visually better for the the entirety if it faced towards the new life new life drive the, the okay so it's not going to face dave ward regardless it's going to face we we would be absolutely elated if it if it could uh face dave yeah ward. harp harps has said that's a, a that's non-starter okay. yeah so that, that's where we started out first I got you. I'm, I'm um our, our consideration in looking at that and we we had them present us uh, various renderings uh if it if it is oriented back towards country club then one of the primary views, if you're coming from uh, coming from the west and looking up into that site, you'll see a, a large loading area, which is not necessarily the, the most attractive uh, view of the facility. Additionally, if you're coming from the east and let and the sort of the, the main entrance there of New Life is a little bit of a, a terminating vista off of that driveway. Uh, if it were oriented in a way where the the structure faced towards the the new life drive and the majority of it was placed back closer to, to country club it, it would have a better view shed in terms of looking at when you're coming on from the east on Dave Ward actually being able to see new life's campus because because of all the buffering requirements in it being a loading area that area the new life drive we would require pretty heavy evergreen screening so it would it would do a lot to block the view of of new life coming from the east so that that was really i think our the planning department's primary considerations is just from a from a site design standpoint um accommodating that that those now those 
those things are not specifically a direct condition, I don't think, as, as part of this, uh, as part of the conditional use. It's, it's really those were things that were going to be finally and absolutely hammered out uh, as part of the de development review application. But, you know, I'll say I, I, I think it would be, I think it would be a, an unfortunate circumstance for it to uh, not face the, the new life driveway. So. We have so a coming, So going west down Dave Ward, you're going to come up on that corner and see the back of Hart? You would, really what you'd be more likely to see in that situation is the gas. Um, we have a unique situation here in that we have Harps and the church getting along quite well and wanting to work together. And I, I think I think we go ahead and let them go with the plan that they have. Uh, the Harps, from what I understand, is willing to work with the city as well on Country Club. And we as a city realize we've got to finish up from the bridge south there uh, as well. So my personal view, and I, I don't express a whole lot of things like this, this is this is pretty easy. Yeah. Let them let them let them move forward. Yeah. Like, like Dad used to do me when I come to or something. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Was it Jeffrey? Is that is that correct? Yeah. It, yeah. Are you okay with just getting with our planning department and working this out that where it's best for y'all? Because I we don't appear to have any yeah. button heads on this. Y'all's planning department has a lot of rules, but they're extremely easy to work with, and I have no problem working with them. They're, the, the planning department's amazing. We happen to disagree on this one item, but honestly, they're a huge help to New Life as a whole. I work with them on a regular basis. Tell me again which way you would rather... Yeah, if y'all want to look at the screen just so everybody's yeah, on the I same page. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Basically, what we would like is the back of the building be... Fa uh, the back of the building currently, as the planning commission, or excuse me, planning department has recommended, the back of the building would be closest to Country Club Road, and back it would face building. out towards our towards your property. That's correct. Okay. Um, and what mainly for traffic count reasons, I actually agree with James. Uh, it would be prettier towards our front entrance in the way that they have it face. But for traffic count reasons, and because we do have multiple school things happening on campus, um, it, it would be best if we could remove as much traffic and flip the orientation to where now the building would be facing Country Club instead of that back to Country Club. So they won't be able to access from your drive? They would, Country but it Club would be a supplemental. Okay. And we're, we're, not, we're not Xing that off of, it would be a supplemental rather than the main. I'm like you, Mr. Mayor. I think you should let them, let y'all work it out. Where's that going to put the gas pump? You know what? I, honestly, we don't have a ton of opinion at this point, but but that hasn't gotten to a point where we would have, and I think I think between the three of us, between the planning department and HARPS, we can figure that out. I was just willing to work with them and get it done, right? Basically. Well, and, and the planning department made this very clear at one point, but uh, – Something's going in there, as y'all mm -hmm. made the point of just right. a few minutes ago in the other mm -hmm. property. Something's going in there. Harps is extremely easy to work with, and we want to move forward if we can with them. Thank you. Any, anyone else like to speak for or against? Yes, sir. You know where that would put the gas pumps? Kind of probably central in the side, and it, I mean, if it's possible to get a right sweep in only, we would love that. But um, I think that that so is, Ward. yeah. Um, I mean, we would be willing to to do that. You know, the right turn in sweep. But I think with the three different organizations that have an input on that, I've heard that that's might be the most impossible thing. Thank you. Any other questions? Council, back to you. Make a motion to approve this conditional use request with all the conditions listed. Second. I have a motion and a second to approve this conditional use permit for HARPS with all the conditions listed. Any further discussion? 
Mr. Garrett. All in favor say aye. 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 All opposed. Passes seven to zero.